hi everyone and welcome back to my channel so i tried my hardest i really really did but i caved in and i couldn't stay away we're back with another depop haul i know it's so close and so soon to the last one i have a problem a really really big problem jack even tried to put me on a depop ban because it got that bad i literally tried it like a social media app and i was on there 24 7 i kid you not but, I mean, it's not that big of a problem because it means I can bring you guys in the haul, do you know what I mean? Again, like last time, I will link all the sellers in the description box if you are interested in any of the pieces or the brands, I guess, that I bought from. Just a pre-warning now, this is 10 times better than the last one. So you might want to stick around. Oh, I wasn't even planning for this to be a video, but I got that many good things I just had to share. So, hope you guys do enjoy this. Give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, turn on post notifications. Also, don't forget to check out my Instagram and go follow me over there to see these pieces styled up. And without being said, we're just going to get on with the Depop haul. So the first few things I have to show you are actually gifted from Vimpery and Clothing. And she actually does have a Depop page as well as a website. So I'll link both of them below. But I've bought from her in the past and she has gifted me a few things as well. Because she's like, honestly, the sweetest. Love the bits. I shared me a DM over on Instagram. Asked if she could send a few bits over. And I was like, yes, perfect. Because I'm filming a Depop haul. And I can also feature these on my main Instagram page. So that's what I'm going to start off with. Now she's doing a load of like reworks. Like sweatshirts, hoodies tops, joggers, like you name it, she's got it on her website, as well as these corsets, which she makes herself and oh, honestly, I, I, when she sent this over, I was like, yes, 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 like didn't even have to think twice. I was like, please, thank you very much. I, just, oh, I was speechless, do you know what I mean? Do I even need to explain? Do I even need to explain? I mean, just look at it. How fucking beautiful is this top? It is the most perfect Burberry little corset crop has the little kind of like shoulder ties and then the back has obviously the little corset tie up detail. The fact these are handmade literally blows my mind because I can't even tie my shoelaces half the time so the fact she can actually like create this, how? I'll never know. I actually have kind of like a little matching headband from my last Depop haul if you watch which is going to look absolutely gorgeous with this. Please 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 just go check out her page, you will not regret it, I promise you that for sure. I'm in love, cannot believe that I own this and that this is mine. What the fuck? I'm gonna move on to the next item, which she also kind of gifted over, which just how I don't even know. Thank you, <laughs> honestly, thank you. So the next thing she sent over was this super soft, like fleecy, three quarter zip little cropped North Face reworked jacket. God, that was a bit of a mouthful. <laughs> this feels so nice. I don't even know how to describe like the material of this, but it literally feels like almost plush. That's definitely not the right word, but like it's super, I don't even know, so soft anyways. I actually have an item that I'm going to show you guys next, which this would look perfect with because it's like matchy matchy with branding, do you know what I mean? But yeah, love this, honestly living these style. I actually have a grey one like this from Depop a couple years ago from 90s Baby Vintage, I think that's the name. I can't quite remember. Perfect for like dog walks and stuff like that. Just cute little winter essentials. Like going into these sort of colder months, this is going to be perfect. And I know she has quite a few different colours. These on her website. Yeah, this is honestly like the most versatile piece. You can wear it with literally anything, everything. And it's going to keep me nice and cosy. So thank you so much for sending those over. Again, everything will be linked below if you want to go show her some love, which I definitely, definitely think you should do because she's honestly the nicest gal ever. Love you lot. Sticking with the theme of North Face, I guess, I actually picked myself up a coat. Now, I've been wanting a North Face coat for so long, but I was not willing to pay like 200 and odd pound for a puffer coat. No, thank you, ma'am. <laughs> I'm not made any money. And also, there are so many on Depop. I was like, what is the point in buying a brand new one when people are trying to sell them and get rid of them? Like, I might as well just take one <laughs> for myself. You know what I mean? So, I picked this one up from Grab the Brand. Now, again, I've worked with these on Instagram in the past. I went on the Depop page that shit on a whim at like 12 o'clock the other night. And I saw that they had one left in a size small. And I was like, you are mine. <laughs> I was like, bye, bye, bye. I have no regrets. I have no regrets. This is one of the, now I'm going to absolutely butcher the name. It's either Nupsts or Nups, Nupsy, Nups, no. I have no fucking clue. But it is one of the kind of popular North Face jackets that are floating about at the minute. But this is what I said would look nice with the piece that I just shown you. Laid underneath just keep me nice and warm. Obviously it is kind of like a vintage one so it's not going to be like brand new sort of condition. Which obviously I knew paying the price that I did. She was 145 I'm pretty sure. So a little bit of an investment but these coats literally last a lifetime. And I actually recently just got rid of my old black puffer that I didn't wear anymore. So this is like going to be in replacement to that and it's going to be my new 
every day sort of winter coat. Super nice and soft on the inside, honestly the most perfect fit. And I'm just in love. Honestly, I went with these for the longest time. And the fact that it was like the last one in my size was just like a sign. And I was like, you need to be mine. And we made it happen. So this is my new coat. She's pretty cute. Kind of feel like such a basic bitch with this now because I feel like everyone's got it. I'm like, oh, look at me, my little face kit. But it's beautiful. And I don't regret any of it. Love it to bits. I feel like I'm just repeating myself again, but I have worked with quite a few vintage brands over on my Instagram, so they're the ones I always go to to buy my bits and bobs because I know that they're fab. So this next piece is actually from Pocket Vintage, who I bought my nude and black Adidas puffer from, which everybody always asks me about. I saw this on there and I was like, this is really cute. Kind of similar to the sort of vibe from my last Depop video with the nude Disney sweatshirt. But this is like a cream sort of waffle little cropped jumper. It's Reebok, has this gorgeous baby blue branding on. This is what sold me. I was like, I don't know what my obsession is with blue. I said this in the last one as well. Just thought this was super nice and simple. Again, just building up a wardrobe with basic pieces that are going to last me a long time. And things I can pair with everything that are not just like random out there, spare the moment sort of purchases. Do you know what I mean? Again, another brand which I 110% recommend you guys to go check out. Run by the sweetest girls ever and yeah I love my new little jumper definitely didn't realize I bought this much stuff but this next piece I was actually wanting to feature in my first ever Depop video but it didn't come in time because this actually did take a while to arrive but this is from a brand called KB Label who designs and literally makes her own piece of clothing which is fab I ordered this September I'm pretty sure and this came like a week ago but it is from Scotland and it was handmade and I don't know if she was like working during the Covid or whatever so obviously I don't blame her for it taking a while because obviously she makes it all herself so I'm not gonna be that bitch that's like oh my god this took so long do you know what I mean? It is this gorgeous little zebra bodycon dress. You can completely customise this like you pick the size you want if you want it to be strapless or if you want some little straps on. I went for the strapless it's literally just your basic sort of little bodycon dress. It literally just looks like a piece of fabric here but once you have this on it is so flattering. It's a little bit short on me not gonna lie it's a cheeky little dress but I don't mind that because I think it's the most flattering on me and yeah this is really sweet literally so cheap as well to say this was handmade it was only 16 pounds i know fab love this little dress and i'll link it below if you're interested another piece from a brand i'm obsessed with is absolutely waved you guys will have seen on my instagram if you follow me over there if you don't then go do but they sent me out a little red and white champion bralette and they recently started making like these little patchwork like pieced crop tops and asked if they could send one out which honestly i was just like oh. and they're such like a unique brand i've never seen anything like what they create like they literally just take like old t-shirts that people don't wear anymore and transfer them into like the cutest little tops ever and they sent out this one for me which oh, you'll have seen it over on my instagram because i almost nearly cried over this but it was so pretty it's a little nike gray pink and white cropped top is this not the prettiest top you've ever seen in your life i know how cute is that but the fun thing about this you guys can literally go on the website and choose any three colors you want your top to be made with so it's basically like you get in your own top designed and then they make it for you and send it out which is honestly like the most amazing idea ever it's so pretty again if you watched my last video i'm sorry i keep referring back to that but there is quite a few like links from this to that video uh, why can't i stop burping oh my god uh. <laughs> i basically mentioned shop wavy baby which is again one of my faves and it was like the little black kind of like crossover top and she actually recently came out with a few other colours so I picked myself up the exact same one in white but this is in kind of like a scuba material super thick and stretchy and not see through which we love because it's white it's all like double layered and lined and everything because obviously I featured in my last video and she's like the sweetest girl ever she kindly sent out a zebra print one with the order that I made of this I mean I'm obsessed because I love these style tops they're so flattering especially if you have a little chest like me these work wonders and honestly i like the prettiest little tops ever you can wear them so many different ways like you can literally just wear it as a bandeau like this and then have it tied at the back you can tie it around your neck in a crisscross tie it around your neck like vertical is that vertical i have no idea but they're fab cute little pieces and they're honestly so good for the price these are all under a tenner so absolutely fab
Thanks, Deb. Thing is, right, when I was getting these stuff, I was kind of just like putting them away. And then as Warren Mark kept coming, I was like, right, I'm gonna put them all to one side for a video so I know where they all are. And then I kind of haven't touched them for like a week or so, two weeks maybe. And now I'm coming to the realization of how much stuff I've actually bought and thinking to myself, you need to stop. Now I understand why Jack tried to put me on Depop ban. <coughs> Love that. But your gal picked herself up some of the most basic pants on the scene at the minute. And if you haven't guessed already, I got myself some juicy bottoms. <laughs> Basic bitch, basic bitch, basic bitch. I was looking for them on Depop basically because I was like, might as well. Most people selling them brand new because I haven't fit anyway. And I found this gal who was selling these in my size, extra small. And I thought, why not? I'm just gonna do it. Like, if I don't like it, I can always resell them. But they came and I really love. And I hate that I love them because I know people are gonna call these like tacky joggers and wannabe Y2K and all this, but I honestly could not give two flying fucks because these are so nice. <laughs> You'll have all seen them by now, but I know they're like crazy, in your face, diamond -y glitter. I like them and I'm not ashamed to say that. They're bloody fab. They've got the little zip pockets, which is a fab idea because I'm forever dropping my phone out of them. Obviously the infamous little design on the bootay and then the little drawstring waist, which is perfect. Go out the bottom as the little flares. Now these are a little bit long, so if you guys are short, just a pre-warning, I'm 5'3 and these go below my feet, like they're quite long. This would just like a regular black long sleeve little crop would look super cute with little air forces, either black or white, whatever you're feeling, whatever vibe you're going for. They do also do matching jumper jacket things, but that was like a little step too far for me. I was like, we'll just keep it the joggers for now. And I'm so happy I did. 60 quid, well bloody spent. Sorry for how high I'm in this video as well. Could not tell you why. I'm stuck in my house in lockdown doing nothing. So all my energy is just like whoo, focused on the camera right now. Oh, we don't mind. Then I picked myself up a pair of nude cream jeans. I wanted a pair of straight, like, kind of light wash, off-white sort of jeans for the longest time. Obviously checked on Depop beforehand because that's, like, my first place to go. Now whenever I want something, I'm like, just check Depop because you never know, you might find it. And to my surprise, I did. Brand new with tags, may I just say, as well, for 15 quid. But they are these pull and bear little straight leg cream jeans honestly could not be more perfect i know and they have the split hem at the bottom which is sewn in at the minute and i'm all here for and again these are a little bit long for me so i'm gonna just get the scissors and choppy chop along the bottom like i did my zara ones because it makes them the perfect fit and also gives them a cute little raw edge hem whatever the word is i don't know high waisted obviously just your regular jeans but the fact these are like brand new with tags for 15 quid i was gonna get some of these from primark before it shut and i didn't get a chance this was like a dream come true and I'm very excited to style these because this is one thing I've wanted to own for the longest so very happy about it, do you know what I mean? Another piece of clothing I love having quite a small chest is the racer tops, what they're called, they're kind of like high neck cut tops, high cut neck tops? What? But I found this one from a seller on Depop and it was literally £7 and it is so beautiful, gorgeous nude little high neck top I know and it has little like white lines going through it it's so beautiful in a size extra small but the fact it's just seven pound and it's a holister one I was like what literally perfect condition not a single thing wrong with it and then the back of it has a little crossover detail you can find such bargains on depop I know a lot of the things I've bought in this haul are quite expensive like the coat and the joggers and stuff like that but little bits and bobs like the shop wavy baby crops and this and just like the odd pieces you find off random sellers you save so much money and you can get such good deals and this is one of them absolutely love really into these sort of colors at the minute and perfect for winter because it's like a knitted thick material and also I don't need to wear a bra so win-win and the last item you'll be glad to hear because I've been rambling on for so long but if you watch my sister does my ASOS shop you'll know I was talking about how much I wanted a flannel jacket jacket sort of thing and obviously I sent that one back because it was just way too big for me and then I went on Depop and a brand called The Individualist I'm pretty sure had a bunch of these sort of jackets in and this is like the colourway I've been looking for the size the fit everything I fell in love with uh, and it was only £25 I know but it's this gorgeous vintage sort of a trucker checkered little shirt jacket it's super thick kind of like almost 
brushed cotton sort of fleecy vibe it's super warm the most perfect like oversized sort of dad style this is a men's extra large so it literally drowns me but i love that style this weird like a little black dress and some cute little shoes if, like literally anything you can put these with so much stuff and it is one of my favorite depop purchases to this day because i was that excited i even did a little instagram story preview before i did this video because i was like i need to show you guys this i know it's not going to be to everyone's taste but for me i love that was the last thing in this haul so that was it for this video i hope you guys did enjoy sorry if it was a little bit long-winded and i was a little bit here there and everywhere jack's now texting me so i'm gonna go but give it a huge thumbs up subscribe down below let me know any videos you want to see from me during lockdown and i will see you in my next video bye S -O -S, never guess, cause I know mama told me that I'm blessed but he never on the show get impressed cause I'm dope you don't smoke what you mean keep it potent as the green so you know this happy tree